Namaste everybody and welcome back to what is a very very cool calm collected on the Star Leaf video because we're doing another episode of Ando opens up an exciting set but we wears a heart monitor so he has to stay cool calm collected. That's probably the worst title for an episode ever. But today we've got such an exciting video because yeah, not only am I wearing another heart rate monitor today because you guys absolutely loved the last one that we did with Shining Fates right here, but the Pokemon company just came through and they not only sent me a brand new Battle Styles booster box right here, so we can potentially track down one of two cards I've been dying to get. Either the Fast Asleep Tyranitar right here, the alternate artwork, everyone loves that card, but I also want the most expensive card in the whole set, the most sought after, Alterna Artwork Rapid Strike Urshifu. And let's be honest, you know what, just the booster box, that's not going to cut it. We're really gunning for these cards. I drastically want one or two Alterna Artworks, so they also sent over a brand new Battle Styles ETB. So we're going to open up all the boosters out of the ETB, we're going to open up the booster box right here, and we're going to have the ultimate search for episode while well, Ando's gonna try and remain cool, calm, collected with the heart rate monitor on. Alrighty guys, you gotta let me know as well in the comments, how are you doing in Battle Styles? I know I had so many requests to open up another booster box. I, everyone's like, Ando, you can't give up. This is actually a really, really fun set. You gotta keep hunting for all the gold cards, all the alternate artwork bangers. And I'm like, you know what? You're 100% right. So when the Pokemon company sent this bad boy over, everything made sense. We just had to go after the remaining two artwork cards I needed. You ready? Oh, look at that brand new, fresh, smelling booster box right there. What's the heart rate sitting at? 90 beats per minute. I haven't had a cup of coffee today, so this is Uncle Ando. No caffeine. Pretty good. All right, so let's open this bad boy up. Looks absolutely gorgeous. I mean, I reckon they knocked out the park. I honestly think this is one of the better sets of 2021, but I'd love to hear your opinion down in the description, down in the comment section. Well, let's get this party started. Oh gosh, oh gosh, I'm gonna hit 100 beats per minute. Watch this, it's 93 right now. Watch me hit 100 just on the first booster. I'm trying my absolute hardest to remain cool, calm, collected. Okay, four from the back on the very first booster. We got a metal type energy right here. Golbat, got a Goliath score. Indeedy making a cup of tea. Got Fromantis, Spiro, Zubat in that Yarn Yoshi style. Cubone, got a Frillish. Reverse Cheryl, and then it's going to be a jealous... Look at this. This is literally when you let your balloon go at your birthday party and goes... <laughs> okay, that was a weirdly disturbing sound that I'm never going to make again, but that's basically what Jellison's doing. Okay, we're on 90 beats per minute. I told you. And oh, I've just got, I've got a black belt in uh, meditation. I just is like cool, calm, collected. When you say Uncle Ando, you think the most calm guy on the planet that never overreacts about anything. Okay. So we got a darkness type energy right here. Got a Honshiro. Then we got Carnivine, which has got oh, which has got the Rapid Strike logo right there. That's what we need. The Rapid Strike Urshifus. They're the ones you want to go for. There's also the Single Strike, which I think have a big fan following. But today we need the Rapid Strike ones or Tyranitar. I mean, on my first ever booster box I opened to the set, we got a full art Tyranitar, and it looked ridiculously gorgeous. I think it's what made me fall in love with the set. Then we also pulled a shiny golden Houndoom card. I would absolutely love the shiny golden octopus as well. So if I can get that, that'd be great. Got a Houndor, got a Lickitung, got a Horsey as well, Mankey, Mawile, and a Reverse Fromantis with a regular Ram Marowak. Come on, boys. We won our first pull of the booster box. Rapid Strike, where have you gone? Oh my goodness. The front half is just a big troll. 93 beats per minute. Keeping a call. We got Unlisted Leaf to start it off right here. Then we got uh, Spupa, Gligar, got a Spoink as well, Bronzor, got a Tepig, Pachirisu, Luxio Reverse, and we've doubled up another Marowak. I'm trying to alternate between the two. I'm like, surely, eventually, we're going to get a white and green code? No way. Okay, let's just hope. This booster box is so stacked. It's so ridiculous right now that it's just waiting to give us the ridiculous pulls in the back half. Or we might have to open up the ETB and change our luck over. Claydol regular rare. All right. Hopefully the red Urshifu, the single strike one, has a little bit better pulls. Oh my goodness. Okay, white and green. That's what I'm talking about. What's our very first pull going to be? What do you reckon, little Timmy? 
If I can get one of these two cards, I don't even know. Probably send my heart rate and break the, uh, com not the computer, the phone. Lick it song. Electabuzz. Esper. Good the timber. Then we've got... Entei Hollow. That's actually pretty good. Yo, I was absolutely blown away when I found out Entei was in this set. How good. I reckon uh, all the dogs should always be a holo card. I love it. My favorite dog is probably Suicune, but Entei, he's always got a special place in my heart. I think because he plays such a big role in uh, the movie. Is it Pokemon 2000, the movie? This is that movie where it just revolved around the three dogs, and Entei was like, what, I think more of the main character over Raikou and uh, Suicune. I remember going to my friend's house and watching it three times in one day. I, w I swear that was normal. Like, I wasn't a weird kid. Like, that that was the in cool thing to do. Okay, I just slash as the regular rare. Wait a minute. Unlisted Leaf. We didn't even do the card trick. Oh, well. I'll take another Unlisted Leaf energy. So far, all that we got is a Holo Ente. And it looks like, like, there's no amazing rares in this set. And we just got another Solar Grain. So I'm thinking something crazy is going to come up soon. Grumpig. Got a Remoraid. How are you guys going? Have you had booster boxes that are like this? Spiro and then the Letrive. Alright, single strike Urshifu. Come on, bud. That's what I'm talking about. Got that beautiful golf ball pattern right there. 101 beats per minute. Ando's starting to panic. I'm in the fat burn zone. What does that mean? I'm burning calories right now? Sweet. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Ando's going to have a six pack by the end of this opening. This is going to turn into a fitness channel. I'm literally going to rename or rebrand it from gaming to fitness. Blip bug, and then... Yes! Come on! That... Ladies and gentlemen, that's the card I didn't even mention. I didn't even mention. I stabbed the leg. Oh, I stabbed my leg with it. I didn't even mention that I wanted this card, but this is a hundred thousand percent of card I was gunning for. I told you this is why it wasn't handing out the goods. Because we were gonna get a banger like this. Golden Rapid Strike Energy. Boom! Yo, this is awesome! Okay, if you don't believe me, like, just go back and watch my previous booster boxes. I keep mentioning this card. It is one I'm dying to get. It is so early in the morning, my neighbors are definitely calling the police. But it's 100% getting arrested over this. That's so fine. Oh! That's the second pull of the box! I knew, I knew there had to be something good coming up because there's like, there's no way that you're just gonna get a casual meek nothing and then, uh, oh, not get rewarded like that. Dude! I'm so stoked we managed to get the Golden Rapid Strike Energy card. Oh, there's so much texture on there and, oh, the energies just look incredible, don't they? The Gold Fist. Okay, but let's put this one in the back. We're definitely coming back to it on the recap. Oh, it feels so good to get a card I'm chasing for, especially when I'm like, you know, the Shining Charizard, I can't find it. Like, honestly, I think it's gone walkabout and it'll never come back home. But just, that is awesome. Let's keep going. I think, um, you know, the alternate artworks that we're hunting for right now, the Tyranitar, the Urshifu, they're cards that can still come up. Like, they're not, they're not like a gold card where it's like, oh, you're only getting one per box. Like, we're definitely not getting another gold card. The alternate artworks will just casually show up, and even if they don't in this booster box right here, say this whole box was based around the energy there, totally fine. The Pokemon Company sent us an ETB as well, and I want to just make this the ultimate episode, um, the ultimate battle styles opening up right here. So we'll just crack open the ETB if we need to. Definitely demolish the like button if you're loving today's episode. I think it took me a while to get started. Especially no coffee or anything. I try to go into this like as cool calm collect as possible so my heart rate doesn't appear like 200 beats per minute. Uh, but we're gonna be sitting at 104 I think for a while. I'm still, my heart's racing over that card. And also I stabbed my knee into the chair. The chair like I lifted it up, it went straight into the leg. Alright, put you to the side. Another solid green. Yo, this box is literally just handing out bangers, and that's it. No, like, you know, oh, maybe I'll give you a Beedrill Holo. Oh, no. It's it's just going to give us an Entei Holo and a Gold Rapid Strike Energy. There is no greater feeling in getting the card that you want, though, Mr. Rhyme. It looks like we're getting about halfway through this booster box right now. Like, we're making some good dents. Oh, jeez. Really cracked that one open. Is it going to be something? No way. 
the front half of this box, it was so sneaky. All regular rares, bar a hollow and a gold card. Which, I mean, if this was in, like, your local news agency, fair enough. That's actually pretty good, because, like, little Timmy that pulled that one gold card, very, very GG. But, for everyone else, it'd be a bit sad. I wonder if the, uh, how the Pokemon company selects these booster boxes to give out, though. Do you think they just walk down to the, like, factory downstairs, pluck one off the line, pop it in a box and send it out? Because these are... <laughs> it definitely varies in pulls, doesn't it? I'll take it, though. That's just really cool. More Grumpy, more Pika right there. Back to the opening, though. Scatterbug, Hone Edge, Gligar, Scatterbug, and Marowak. <sighs> Alright, there we go. Look at that. 98. Yes, sir. Under 100. Let's keep going. Tyranitar. Might have to clean the, uh, the setup in a second. Ah, oh, I really hate that these are, like, dwindling away. Okay, here we go. This is our third good pull. And I kid you not, our third good pull. There's the uh, code card. <laughs> Let's see what it's going to be, guys. What do you think? Something ridiculous again? It wouldn't even surprise me at this point. Water? Gosh, this set is the set that keeps on giving. Onyx? Mawile? Cherubi? What do you think? Chimeco? Victory Bell Reverse? Kingdra? Holo card. I reckon we've just hit, like, you know, we've just gone over the speed hump, which is the middle of the booster box. And now we're getting into pull zone. Now we're getting into what my uh, Fitbit likes calling the fat burning zone. That's the part of the booster box one right now. Four from the back. Okay, here we go. Psychic, Golbat, Bruno, Carcol. Got a Murkrow as well. Hone Edge, Electabuzz, Baltoy, and Agislash. Drampa is like left, right, and center. Maybe they're like teasing something. Maybe they want Drumper to be... Whoa, okay, here we go. Is our fourth one? Yep, our fourth pull. Maybe they want Drumper to be one of the next mascots. That would be sick. Imagine a whole set based around Drumper. A little bit late, but would be cool still. Okay, fourth pack. All right, ready? I mean, fourth pull. Terror Darkness. Timber. He's literally building a house, which is quite ironic. Glam Meow. Silly Cobra. King's Reverse. And then... Oh, that's pretty good, because I haven't pulled this one either. Tyranitar V-Card. Oh, fantastic. This is actually a really, really good box, guys. Tyranitar V Single Strike. Oh, I love the computer CGI, like, generated artwork right there. Very, very nice. Single Strike Crush is one of the attacks as well. Dude, okay, let's clean up all this. Only get about, I want to say, less than half of the booster box to go. But... So far, really good. All right, guys, one V card, one gold card, and two hollows. That's all that we got. We're sitting on about 91 beats per minute right now, which is absolutely beautiful. That's what I love to see. Keeping it under 100. Whew. All right, all right, let's go, let's go. Single strike. Single strike Urshfu seems to give out slightly better pulls than rapid strike. I gotta say, look, 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 look. okay. Prime example. I don't know why, he just does. So there you guys go. Four from the back. This is our first booster back. This is going to be our fifth pull of the box. What could it possibly be? I still think we're going to get a uh, fuller card because I really do believe that gold card, it's going to be randomly inserted. Hone Edge, Horsey, got a Mankey. It's not Shining Fate, so the reverse doesn't count. And a Meowstic as the Hollow. We are racking and stacking all of the Hollows right now. But I reckon we got more to come. This is the Rapid Strike Urshfu right now. Open you up, put you to the side. There's the code card. Hopefully you guys are getting brilliant stuff in the codes. And if you get anything fantastic, remember to tweet me. Tag me in your Instagrams. At Unlisted Leaf. I want to see them. Hone Edge. Gligar. Electabuzz. And a Cinder Scorch again. Why is Cinder Scorch in every single set? I swear, he's just showing up left, right, and center. All right, there we go. White and green. This is going to be our sixth pull of the box. I love how I can count how many pulls we got. Because it's like, it doesn't overwhelm you, I guess. Like, Shining Fates is pretty like, bang, 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 bang. This set is just like, it, where, it, where it hits, it really does count. Scatterbug, Cubone, Mustard. Oh, that's pretty good. Victini VMAX. I remember pulling this one in Japanese, and I remember pulling it in our previous Star Battle Styles opening, but that's completely fine. If you're going to double up, it might as well be a Victini VMAX right there. Max victory, spreading flames. What do you guys think of this card? 
He's got massive blue eyes. Like, they're ridiculous. Victini's dating profile would go off, you know? Big blue eyes. Hits now on the head. All right, Victini, you go at the back. So that's our... I want to say one of our first doubles. I mean, minus the holo cards, we haven't actually doubled up that much on this uh, opening today. The Tyranitar V and the Rapid Strike Energies. Bean Sapphire, like, really keen on getting. Zubat, Remoray, got an Onyx, Mawile, got a Cherubi, Sizzlipede, and a Conklador. Regular rare. 96 beats per minute. I'm starting to panic a little bit, I think, because there's not much of a booster box left. And this only has, I think, yeah, it's only got eight boosters inside. I mean, it should have decent pulls. ETBs have been really nice to me recently, besides the Shining Fates one, but... Yeah, we're dwindling away. Here we go. Our seventh pull of the box, guys. What could it possibly be? 95 beats per minute. Unlisted Leaf. Oh, it's going down. Let's go. Thero. Escape Rope. Grumpig. Got a Murkrow behind Yampa. Slandit. Mean fool. And then... Crobat again. Whoa. We definitely haven't pulled this one before. That is a stunner. Oh, I love that card. Look at him. It's like a really smoothed out... Smoothed out sort of uh, CGI generated artwork. Do you think Crobat has fur? Does he look like a type of Pokemon that would have fur on him or not? I, was, I don't know. A bit of random thought of the day. And those weird early morning thoughts. Maybe? Because I think Bat's got fur. So Crobat probably have a bit of fur, wouldn't he? Because he is looking quite smooth in that photo, but it's like, you know, it wouldn't be scaly or anything like that. It'd be furry. Weird thoughts. I'm sorry. Why do you even watch Unlisted Leaf? I apologize. All right, Yampa, Lickitung, Sheep's Reverse, and there we go. Scatlin V card. Whoa, I didn't know Scatlin had another V card. Heck yeah. Okay, we definitely need this for the collection and the binder update as well. Scatlin V, double dip thanks. My man's double dipping. And then we got a wild tackle with 200 as well. 98 beats per minute. Ladies and gentlemen, Scatlin has put us in the fat burning zone. As I said, this is a fitness channel, guys, all right? If one of you subscribed, you didn't subscribe for Pokemon, it's how to open Pokemon cards as a fitness regime. Let's go. Metal type. Got a Glide score. Scatterbug, Cubone, Murkrow, Tepig, Hone Edge, and then Primeape as the single strike. Tyranitar. I think, I really do. I think we're guaranteed another VMAX. I think we're going to get another full art, and I reckon we got one more V card. With such little boosters to go. Let me know if you're still watching down below. 104! Panic stations. I'm feeling hot. Like, it's so accurate. When my heart rate goes up above 100, I start to get a bit hot. And it's fascinating. Alright, anyway, sorry. I'm saying revelations over here. Share him! Ah! No way! No way! Are you kidding me? Alright! Holy Oculiva in West Virginia! There is no way! Oh my! Oh, I just, I, oh my gosh! This is hands down the best booster box opening I have done in years! In years, guys! Rapid Strike Urshifu VMAX Rainbow Rare? Golden Rapid Strike Energies in one box! I told you! I literally knew it! Okay, it's calming down, it's calming down, it's calming down. We're gonna bring the heart rate below 100. Can we do it? <sighs> no, we're not gonna be able to do it. All right, anyway. Li okay, seriously, seriously though. This is why it was so dud at the beginning because it was waiting on us to just pull these two cards. It knew that this was a stacked roster of a box. I did not expect this out of this box. I'm so happy. Thank you again to the Pokemon company, like... You, ah, oh, you definitely picked the right one off the factory floor. It's a secret as well, 169 and 163. I'm going to come back to it on the recap. If you haven't demolished the like button, please, right now, demolish the like button, share it around with your friends, as if this is an opening. Do we even open the ETB? Like, I'm starting to question, I just kind of want... No, you know what, we're opening it because if we get alternate artwork anything, I swear I'm done. I'm retiring. Oh, I literally walked my chair around my room just then. Dude, that is such a good card. I don't even know which one I like more right now. What do you think? Okay, seriously, comment question of the day, everyone. Rainbow Rare Rapid Strike Urshifu VMAX. 
or the energy gold card. And usually, hands down, it'd be the Urshfu. Like, that's hot. It's the mascot. It's a rainbow rare VMAX. But seriously, guys, think of the colors on those gold cards. The colors are unbelievable. Jeez. Oh, I'm so happy right now. Okay, so we got uh, Unlisted Leaf type. Duran? Then we got... Okay, you know what? We got like eight. I reckon eight boosters left. Surely we can get something in eight boosters. What do you think? Cacnea. Gligar. And a mean show. Okay, we're still in the fat burning zone. 101 beats per minute. Oh, no. Back to the... Uh, it, I, I, it knows. It literally knows. It's like, I can't give you anything else. Seriously, Ando. Just start dealing with the solid greens because you're not getting it. Oh, look at that. We got that in the gold form. You're not getting any more rainbow rare gold cards. Do you reckon we could get another full art? Or is that asking too much? Because technically we haven't got a full art yet. Technically. Like a regular boring full art. Not the special secret rare ones. 100. Let's go. Below. Come on, Ando. Let's get below 100. Can I do it? Is it going to work? Come on! No, nah, it's going to stay at 100, isn't it? Okay. I'm going to clear this desk off for the final five boosters, I reckon. It's all down to these. And I think it's going to be something inside of them, too. Fromantis, Spiro, Dotler, Phalanx, Rapid Strike. Let me clear this off, because I just want all the room for the final... I think it's six, actually. This could be a good opening. Yum, Marcus up there. I'm begging you right now. You've got to come through with the goods. Let's go. Single Strike Urshfu. Known as the Urshfu that literally comes through with Clutch and pulls through for Ando. There you guys go. If he's not pulling through with me, definitely come through with the code cards. So we got a Lightning type. Grumpig. Scroll. And then we got, oh gosh, everyone's favorite. Massive Teethed Fish. Yampa. Murkrow. Salandit. Horsey Reverse. And Lorantis. Hitting us with the regular rare. Open up this one. Second one in. Of course it's going to be a white and green. 98 beats per minute in the fat burning zone. Fighting type. Per ugly. Tower of Darkness. A few people mentioned they want the uh, heart rate monitor on every video. If that's something you guys are keen for, like, is it to just be a permanent feature, let me know. Onyx. Got a Phoebe. Octillery as the hollow. It's just teasing us. Octillery comes with that shiny gold card. Um, but it's okay. I don't really want it anymore. I feel like I've been so spoiled on this box that whatever we get, I'm really happy with. So I just want to finish this one. Oh, I want to finish this off strong. But in saying that, I mean, if it's going to give it to us, I wouldn't say no. Fire type. Phoebe. Carnivine. Got that Fero. Flip bug. Rolly Coley. Shimeko. Sizzlypede. Got the Roly Coley. And not too shabby. Mimikyu V card. Again, this is another double up, but I'm not going to get mad at all. Mimikyu's such a huge fan favorite. I think this artwork is so beautiful in the CGI form. And it really does look like his eyes have been just sharpied in. Like someone just went, ee, 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 and they just like, you know, rubbed it in. Because they don't look fully filled in. But Mimikyu V card, let's take it. Final four packs of this ridiculous booster box. 95 beats per minute. Oh yes, this is it. It's hitting towards the back of the box right now with a white and green. Come on, full art card. Cedra, Weeping Bell, EXP Share, Romantis, Remoraid, and Pachorizu, Cherubi, and then... Ah! I swear! I swear! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Wait, no way! No way! Oh my... <laughs> I'm done. I am done. Oh my gosh. Arceus, you absolute... Oh, I was joking. I was literally joking about this actually happening right now. And it's it's happened. There is... There is no way on the absolute planet that this actually happened right now. I, I honestly... I'm going to leave my ETB sealed. Because there is only so far you can push your luck, guys. Let me know if you want this open down below. But I think for now, seriously, I want this just to be a video about the booster box because I want this. I want to go back when I'm 80 years old and watch this as the most ridiculous battle styles opening ever. We got Rainbow Rare Rapid Strike Urshifu, the Rapid Strike Golden Energy Card, 
and I pulled the card I was dying to get. I'm pretty sure this is like a $200 card or something in Australia. Oh, that is such a good looking card. What do you think? Everyone's debating like what happened to uh, Tyranitar. They're like, did he just finish getting into a fire? Did he go to sleep? Did he eat all the food there? Is he drunk? Like no one knows. Let me know what you think happened to Tyranitar there. It's a bit miscut, like that's a lot thicker than that's a bit thin down here. But who cares? Who on it? Like, what a pull! <sighs> oh my gosh. I can't believe I did that. I, I'm done. I'm The only card I really need out of um, Battle Styles is Rapid Strike, Alternate Artwork, Urshifu. But like, seriously? As if that's it. So let's do it. Final three boosters. I want to leave that sealed in my collection as a memento to the time that we... Opened up a ridiculous booster box. Um, sorry, I'm so I'm so flustered. I'm never this flustered. I think because I think it's because um we did all the shining Charizard episodes, and I've been so unfortunate that I really can't believe right now that this has happened. Oh, I'm praying all this footage is saving right now because I just can't, I'm literally gonna edit this and throw it on YouTube today if I can. Corefish, Cacnea, Mawile. Second to last pack. Yo, I got, I I've got like five friends I gotta send this video to because I seriously am flustered. Oh my gosh. It's another white and green. What the heck is it? My chair's my chair is at the back and I could not care less, right? Now, if I get anything else, I think I'm done though. So I reckon the gold card must be randomly inserted. I don't think that's meant to be part of the ratio. Frillish, blip bug, roly coly, what do you think it is? Oh, of course, Empoleon, mascot of the set, of course, why not? Okay, I'm gonna cry. Empoleon V card. You got the back, and our final booster. This is it, single strike. What is it? Oh, I told you, it's all at the back. What are the chances? Anyone that bailed on this video early, I'm so, I feel so bad for. Because they, they missed out on it. What an episode. Blip bug. Mankey, Sizzlypede, wow, Agislash Holo card. Let's have a recap and just do the seat build up now. <music> Ladies and gentlemen, there is not many times at all in my entire career I can actually say that booster box was everything I wanted and more. But this is exactly what happened today. I still can't actually believe what went down. Um, I'd love to hear your thoughts in the comment section below. Have you had a similar box? Have you ever seen this before? But holy moly, let's just do it. So we're gonna Entei as the holo card. Even the holo cards weren't even too bad and I feel like they were building us up to what happened later in the box. Got a Crobat, got an Octillery as well and Agislash. Even got a Tyranitar V. This is unreal. There has to be someone at the factory that programmed the types of pulls that went into this. Like Tyranitar V, Scoutland V as well, Mimikyu V card and Empoleon, a mascot. The only V match we got was Victini. Not even a bad one, but they sacrificed all the other cards so that we could get the bangers like we did. Tyranitar alternate artwork V card right here. I would have been happy if this was the rarest card in the box and the only thing that we got, but Rapid Strike Urshifu V Max, and I kid you not. That is ridiculous on its own. That is such an overrated, awesome pull that everyone wants. But this card as well? I, I have no words. I'm, for the first time in my life, just speechless. Um, I want to frame this, this over video. I think this video might even be the trailer to my YouTube channel. I'm going to reset it. I love battle styles. I would 100% recommend going out to get some. I'm on top of the world. Thank you so much for watching. Please demolish the like button, share it around, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't. It would mean the absolute world if we can get the 3 million subscribers, but... Whoa, what a day. This is ridiculous, guys. Alright, anyway, I'm gonna sign off and uh, I need to recover. Keep on gaming. I'll see you then.